all hail the Gubs of Army, and what have I for you today, my friends? Well, a review of Blastwave. Yes, I know I did a review with the Ninja, but this one is a little more in-depth and actually will show the transformation and also get a better look of the packaging right there. Warrior class, yes. Of course, Blastwave, which really is just bludgeoned with another name. And right there, 13 steps, apparently still playing the game, I guess, and all the stuff at the bottom, bra bra bra, go over here to the side, back to the front. So yes, let's take a look at Blast Wave. Oh look, it's an amazing future tank. Yeah. Okay, so Blast Wave's uh, Alternate mode is a future tank, and to be honest, yeah, I really don't like future tank modes because it just gives the Hasbro designers carte blanche to be uh, lazy. Yeah. So you end up with things like this. I mean, there you go, the top. And there's some nice molding on it, but you know, ultimately it's just like, okay, yeah, that's, that looks like a tank. And I'll bring in Megatronus because um, Blast Wave is a heavy remold of Megatronus. So if you see, you can see the legs, the legs are pretty much exactly the same except for these two spots here, but yeah. And for transformation, you know, Megatronus, his arms are up front, whereas for Blast Wave, they put his arms in the back, and they are remolded there to be a little beefier. So, that's what we have. So let's go and get um, Blast Wave into his robot mode. Now let's get Blast Wave into his... Uh, robot mode take off the sword come over here we're gonna pop the foot and flip it down to here take the kneecap flip that down so we come back on this side and repeat flip that all the way down there take the kneecap flip it there and then you can straighten the leg now also just a, a nice thing about him is he pegs in very well so right here you see the peg and you unpeg it there. So there and there. Halfway done. You have the arms. Take the arms. Separate the arms like that. Okay, we'll just go flip that to the side. Pull down the arm and then you just rotate. So again, rotate this this way. Flip down the arm, rotate. And then take the head, flip the head. Rotate the head, and then this part is going to plug in right there. So you just take those, plug that in, take the guns, flip them up, and there you have bludgeoned. I mean, blast wave, blast wave. Definitely not bludgeoned. I mean, why would I say that? There's absolutely no relation between, you know, bludgeoned and blast wave. Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking. I must be insane, but yeah. There you go. So let's take a closer look at Blood Blast Wave. Blast Wave. Yeah, that's what I said. You have to love this head sculpt. You just have to. It's fantastic. Whoever did it, kudos to you. Great job. You know, and you know, making the joke about him being bludgeoned because he is. I mean, come on. We could say blast off all day. Uh, no, blast off. Blast wave all day long, but really, it is bludgeoned. And he looks fantastic. The only thing to make him better would be, you know, doing... <laughs> would be uh, having him in his traditional orange colors. But yeah, this is great. Um, just showing the side. This here is where the sword can plug in, you know, both sides. So he has a pseudo sheath right there. But yeah. This just really works for a bludgeoned mold. Fantastic, although there's all the hollow right there. Wish it didn't have that. For the, the gun, the gun can. You can flip the gun down if you don't like the shoulders. 
but then it messes with the waist articulation. So actually if you wanted, you could do it this way, then you don't worry about the waist. Um, but yes, fantastic look to them. I mean, the hands, love the samurai look throughout. Um, let's move him back, and we're going to compare him to Megatronus right there. You can see Megatronus just comes off looking scrawny when you look at the two of them. And Megatronus's arms are a bit longer, which really don't help the figure. Having the wider chest just comes off as wider. The shoulders more proportioned, not as proportioned. Kudos to you, Blastwave, because you've won. You've won the war between the two of you. You're the better remold, or the better use of the mold. But uh, we can go here, head, head will do 360, and he can look up in the air, part of transformation. Shoulder, you can do 360. His arm, if you turn it, you can go all the way out to the side there. Below that shoulder, you've got 360, and you've got 90 degree elbow. Waist, you've got 360 spin right there. Hip. Hip is on a ball joint, so you go all the way forward. You go all the way out here to the side over here. Hold on, the arm's out of the way. Right there. Going back, you get hit going back right there. Knee will do a little bit more than 90 degrees. There's your articulation. But really, fantastic figure. I, I wanted to get it because of bludgeoned. And I'm so glad Fu sent this one to me. It's absolutely fantastic. This one is one where, yeah, just pick it up. You see him, pick it up. You'll enjoy it. Why? Because my opinion's the only one that matters. And if I say it's fantastic, believe me, it's fantastic. So please like, subscribe, and share this video. Also, check out Fu Reviews. Check out The One V Revolticon and Rollout. The new film by TFI Creations, I do a bit part, I swindle. But uh, yeah, it's a fantastic video with a really good story. Check that out. All hail the Gubs of Army. Gubs Live out.